thought I dressed a little punky for y'all today. Let me see if I can. I think that's straight. Mm. Anyway, now I promised y'all that I was gonna give y'all a, uh, a what's that? Word? A review about Alice in Wonderland. Well, fuck my Mountain Dew at that is okay. I have to say that it is by far one of the best movies I have seen in a long time as far as, you know, fantasy goes. Me and Polly went out there to see at the movie theaters and everything. And if y'all wondering, yes, I did wear that mad hat a hat <laughs> to the movie theaters. Went and saw the movie and everything. And, uh, oh, Lord, there was, there, there was this old man, okay? And uh, I was uh, about to sit down, and I was right in front of him. And he started bitching everything. He's like, I hope she takes off that goddamn hat. And I turned around, and I looked at this old man, and I said, Methuselah, I'm going to take off that hat. Because there are other people up here that pay just as much money as I did to come see this movie. Now shut the fuck up, sit down, put your 3D glasses on, and watch the movie, okay? And that's exactly what I told him. I turned back around. It starts off, and actually, if you don't know the plot or anything, I'll go ahead and tell you some of it here. It's Alice 13 years later. So she's returning back the Wonderland. She was good in it. And uh, that all that Johnny Depp, oh, he was so good in that. I smell, I already smell an Oscar for him next year. At least an Oscar nomination, because that was really good. It's a little bit different than what you used to with Johnny Depp movies. Uh... Hell bomb caught her up in there and her head was huge. Dang, that's a big ass head. But she still looked good. And then uh the the name of the night, whatever, played by Crispin Glover, who was in uh you ever seen that remake of Willard? And then you also heard some classic people that you thought were already dead, like Christopher Lee and Michael Goth. I thought they were already dead. No, they're still they still here making more movies and shit. But as far as, like, big stars go and everything, Anne Hathaway was in it. She was really good. And Miss Carter and Mr. Depp were in it. And uh, Mia, that new girl, Mia, uh, what's the castle? She was in it, and she good, too. But um, the movie was just good, all in general. The art direction was superb. The, uh, the special effects, the visual effects in it were top-notch. Um, the acting was really good. You, it made you believe you were in Wonderland. I love it. I love Alice Wonderland. I've always been a fan of that of that book and everything. I advise all y'all to go see it while it's still out in theaters. And remember that if if you're like really sick and everything with 3D or IMAX or whatever like that, they got a 2D version out too. So even people who uh, can't stand 3D stuff, they can go see the 2D version. But go see it. Go see it as many times as you can. It's a good movie. Your life depends on it. It's a Tim Burton movie. You cannot deny Tim Burton. He is the master. Bye.